Abdul was driving his Model Y westbound on I-4 in Orlando, Florida. Autopilot was engaged when all of a sudden, a car moving at 70 miles per hour headed right toward him. Autopilot blared an alarm as soon as the car in front of him braked, and Abdul quickly took over and swerved. He didn't know which way he should go to escape in this high-stakes game of chicken. He swerved to the left to avoid a head-on collision, but the car hit the side of his Tesla, sending it into the barrier before sliding across all four lanes to the other side of the highway. The police arrived about a minute later since they'd already been chasing the wrong way driver after receiving multiple calls about him. The cops had to shut down the highway while the intoxicated wrong-way driver was arrested and taken away. Abdul filed an insurance claim and his insurance provider quickly determined his Tesla was a total loss. He's ordered a new one with the same specifications and he's expecting delivery between October 2022 and January 2023. Richard was driving his brand new Model 3 with autopilot engaged in Peachtree Corners, Georgia. He'd just picked up his Tesla a few days earlier and was over the moon. He'd stopped at a red light when, surprise, surprise, the Honda behind him did what Hondas do best. Richard tells us that the Tesla sounded a loud alarm moments before the impact and autopilot moved the car forward slightly as if it was trying to soften the impact. Tesla hasn't confirmed if this is a feature of autopilot or not, but we've had a lot of submitters saying that they've experienced this. We also get a ton of messages from people telling us we're spreading misinformation. Since it says in the official Tesla documentation that autopilot won't attempt to lessen the impact of a rear end collision. We tried to reach Elon Musk for comment on his own social media platform, Twitter. We haven't had any luck yet, but our tweet got a lot of replies from people saying they've experienced it also. What do you think? Do you think autopilot avoids collisions from behind by applying acceleration? John had parked his Model 3 in Austin, Texas. As he walked out of a Best Buy, he witnessed the cart demon in action. A cart was on the loose, so he started chasing it to stop it before it struck. Sentry mode caught the whole ordeal on camera, as well as how it all started. Some guy took a cart, which apparently awakened the demon. After gathering strength for a while, the cart demon finally chose its target, a Mustang parked behind John's Tesla. Here's the exact moment John stepped out of the store and noticed the cart closing in on its prey. Running in an attempt to stop it in time, he shouted, this is so going to wham bam. Thankfully, he was able to stop the cursed cart. Way to go, John. You're this week's real MVP and you've got a wham bam hoodie heading your way. This Model 3 owner was driving outside of a Home Depot in Old Bridge, New Jersey. The cart demon was disguised as a flower cart this time and headed straight for him. Phew, that was a close call. Chris had parked his Model 3 in a parking garage overnight in St. Cloud, Minnesota. When he got back the next morning, he found a rather unusual sentry mode event. It appears that the person who had parked next to Chris was getting ready for a rave, or maybe they were preparing to rob a bank dressed as a furry. Andrew was driving his Model 3 in Yulee, Florida. As he pulled away at a traffic light, a truck tried to roll coal on him, but it couldn't keep up with his Tesla. Calvin was driving his Model 3 in Houston, Texas, when a truck hit another truck with the trailer it was pulling. Calvin isn't sure if they actually made contact or if this was just a close call. We've rewatched the video multiple times and it looks like contact was made to us. Caden was driving his Model 3 in Fort Worth, Texas. Just as he entered a roundabout, he witnessed someone who must have been visiting from England since they took the roundabout going the wrong way.
The guy drove the wrong direction all the way around the roundabout. Caden has no idea what the other driver was thinking, but luckily, nobody was hurt. Bosco was on his first Tesla road trip from Toronto to Montreal to go skiing with a friend. There was a heavy snowstorm when they headed back to their hotel. He was driving around 40 kilometers per hour, about 25 miles per hour, on the highway in a 100 kilometer per hour zone, about 60 miles per hour. That's when his car lost control in the snow and came within inches of hitting the barrier. Luckily, there was no traffic behind them, so he was able to back up and continue their trip. Bosco wants to give a shout out to his friend Vigo, who was in the passenger seat the whole time. He's a fan of both Tesla and Wham Bam Tesla Cam. Since he was in the car, I'd say he got the real Wham Bam Tesla Cam experience. Donald was driving on the Sam Houston Tollway in Texas when he saw a Tesla Model 3 weaving in and out of traffic in his rearview mirror. As the young driver passed him, he almost rear-ended an SUV when there was no room for him to merge in front of Donald. Donald says it seemed like the automatic emergency braking kicked in and this may have saved him from an accident. Harry sent us this video of a Model Y being towed for parking in front of a bus stop in Miami, Florida. It got dragged onto the flatbed with wheels skidding and sentry mode freaking out. Harry wonders if this was actually the new Model X Plaid. It's not, but the Model Y sure looks cool. Rommel had his Model 3 parked in downtown San Diego, California on a Thursday night when somebody decided to show off their dance moves for sentry mode. This must be some kind of sign of approval for the Tesla. Ricky was sitting in his car while charging in Houston, Texas when a Nissan Altima backed into his Model Y. After the impact, the Nissan driver just took off. Ricky jumped out of his car and ran after him on foot. Ricky knocked on their car and they finally stopped, acting like they didn't know what he was talking about. Ricky inspected his car and luckily the Nissan had hit the rear driver's side wheel and there weren't any scratches or other damage. Jeff was driving his Model 3 in Woodside, California when he experienced something you don't see every day. And he's still not entirely sure what he actually witnessed. It was cold and pouring rain outside. Just as he came around a bend, he saw a BMW stopped on the side of the road. Behind it was a woman sporting nothing but her underwear. Do you have any idea what's going on here? Let us know in the comments. Electric Jesus is eagerly awaiting delivery of his Cybertruck. In fact, he's longing for the truck so much that he purchased the big RC version of it and he even made this trailer. Excuse me for a moment while I switch to my movie trailer voice. Destined to travel to Mars. Equipped with bulletproof cabin and zombie nukes. Launched by Starship. And failure is not an option. Winter 2022. Get ready for Cybertruck. Hey, I'm not gonna lie. After seeing that trailer, I think I'm looking forward to my own Cybertruck.